Hi everyone, welcome back. Today we're in Safari and doing another cast for Jebra today. I decided to do looks with only boots as like the shoes, um, just because I didn't really know what to do for this cast video and I was just like, I don't use boots very often um, when creating looks for my normal videos, so I was like, let's just try and create book, uh, boots looks. So I ended up doing eight of them. Um, I started with this green pair. I actually struggled with this first look just because these boots aren't, you know, the greatest looking. Like they're fine. I just didn't know how to style them really until I found like this overall that kind of matched the color of the boots and I was like this, this will do because I don't I was just like yep it, it kind of gives like you know farmer vibes you know um it probably would look better on like a kid um but it's too late um I try to fix it by giving you like nice hair and makeup um to go with the look I don't really know if it saved it that much but it's fine as if there's one done next up I decided to do um, a pair of I guess I don't really know if these are really boots um, I feel like they're actually like heels with like socks over them it's like what they're meant to be but the sims classifies them as boots so I'm wearing them as boots for this video because they are really cute um, and I ended up going for a white and blue look for this one um, I used a werewolf's top and then a pair of white pants um, and to kind of um, just make it all kind of flow really nicely um, yeah, I feel like I did a lot of like wintry looks in this video just because it is really hard to style boots with shorts and skirts um, so hence a lot of winter looks I mean the first look I did wasn't very wintry but from like this point I do a lot of winter ones just because it is a bit easier to do um, so that is that one done uh, next up we have um, obviously another pair of boots I don't really know if these count as, as boots um, but I thought you know they're different um, and the sims class of them as boots so I was like you know what we're gonna do it I would have classified them maybe as platform sneakers um, more so than boots um, but you know but I guess it isn't really I, but I guess it could be sneakers in the sneakers category even if they are platforms but it's fine um, we're using them as boots today anyway um, so yeah and then I put it was a white hat and some standard makeup I didn't want to go too heavy with the, with the makeup for this one and pretty standard jewelry as well and that is that one done next up we have um, again another wintry kind of look um, I went for a pink vibe for this one um, pink and white I guess um, I did struggle to find a pair of pants I like liked enough with them um, I ended up just going for some white trap pants and then pairing it with a pink and white sweater um, I feel like this is very similar as you can see I was comparing it to the first wintry kind of look I did but I was like you know what it works it's cute I'm doing this look I don't care if it's similar um, and I mean it's a bit like I guess a thicker version of the first look um, and obviously pink um, is the main difference is the color um, I also did um, very pink makeup as well um, just because I thought you know um, it would it works um, and then jewelry again presented also gave her some pink glasses I thought that was quite cute and it worked with the look so yeah next up is sorry um, I did like a I guess this is like a goth kind of look you could say um, with the vampires boots which is already like the start of like the goth vibe and then I put it with a high school years skirt and I believe the top is also high school years um, I just thought you know this is quite 
different from what I've been doing and it meant I could also use a skirt um, do a skirt look I guess um, I did spend a bit of time trying to find the top but I eventually ended up with the high school years one um, I paired it with some vampires gloves to give it a bit more of an edge um, and black nails and everything to go with that goth vibe um, and black jewelry um, and I gave her a full brim hat um, thought it worked with it um, standard hair that I thought kind of you know made the look a bit better um, and very dark makeup to go with the goth theme I was going for at this point um, and dark necklaces and everything like that that is that one done um, I was thinking about doing tights um, so I also added some tights in there um, but yeah next up is another obviously boots look as we are already six in at this point um, I, went to, I wanted to go for a um, another kind of wintry look and go for like a brown theme and make it m like a little more um, like I guess more um this is like a snow like a snowing kind of winter look like I feel like the first two were kind of like it's just cold this one you would probably wear if you were like let's say if you were in like the snowy escape world this is something you would wear um and then I did pretty dark makeup again um I thought browns worked with the obviously the look because it was a very brown and beige outfit. Um, I paired it with a beige kind of winter hat um, and yeah that is basically it. I just kind of give you some gloves and stuff to go with it and yeah that is that one done. Nice and simple I guess. Um, next up we've got um, the, these white kind of 60s styles like is it 60s yes um styled um and i paired it with like a short dress i thought that worked with it um i got this blue and white one here i thought it was quite cute um and yeah this is pretty standard look i didn't really this is when it's like a dress it's pretty easy you know there's nothing really i can do um so i then i gave her some long hair as well um i probably should have gone for like some short like 60s start here but i was like you know what i'm gonna go for some long hair um and yeah just some earrings as well but yeah that is that one done very simple now for the last look we have again final boots i went for this gray kind of businesswoman kind of look for the last one but that's about it really so i'm gonna wrap it up here uh thank you guys so much for watching if you enjoyed this video uh let me know and I'll see you guys again soon with another video. Bye.